All right, so today went up Box Hill just to see what my form was like, what my fitness was like, and it was uh, pretty dreadful, to be honest. So Box Hill, if you don't know, is like 2K at 5%. It's uh, an interesting climb. Like, I don't think it's... It's good to do it intervals on because it's very consistent, but anyway, I'm not going to complain about the power. I mean, I just can't seem to put much power out at this moment in time. But anyway, this is it, the segment here, 2.2 kilometers. So we're like 300, that of almost 100,000. So it's like decent, but my power is quite bad today. Um, not great. So you can see here, it wasn't very consistent either. This bit here was a little bit consistent. On this corner, you, you can pedal round, but it's quite tight. Um, and generally, you need to surge out of it. And you can see I got up to some decent speed, but I think that's a GPS error. This was m relatively consistent. And then round this part again, I sort of surged at the end. So it wasn't a great effort, but like, I think the first minute I held like 400, yeah, so the first two minutes I was like where I wanted to be. I thought I'd, you know, I'd be able to hold about 400 for the effort, but I don't know, just this last part here, my cadence was only 80, but I often on these efforts prefer slightly lower cadence. Um, but I think the problem I have is like, I do prefer slightly steeper gradients, but even so, like, it's quite bad. <laughs> like my fitness is not in great condition. Uh, the time I got 25.4k an hour, like I thought I was going to get a little bit faster than that. I thought I was going to do it in about five minutes, maybe maybe five minutes, 10. That was what, sort of what I predicted. Um, I thought I'd do an extra 25 watts more or less, but I didn't. So you go on my power curve and you can see basically 2018. So like for four minutes, I've done like 420 watts. Um, so like, you know, I, I thought, I think for hill climb season, I think 420 watts, I should be able to do that for five minutes, hopefully, because I have more motivation. I'll be in good form, uh, maybe a little bit more. And then for like five minutes itself, I've done 395, but that was up like Kensington Road, which is very steep. It's like a 12% climb. So that definitely favors me more, um, the steeper climbs. But most hill climbs are steep, so that's fine. But it's more just like I do need to be better at putting out power at all times. Um, so you see, this is like a power PR, I think, of all time, like five minutes 40 or something. I don't think I've ever done that but you can see like uh, last year I think my best five minute was like 370 more or less um and the year before that was about um yeah about 340 so you know we gain like 30 watts pretty much every year so it's not it's not too bad um obviously there's a percentage that's decreasing but anyway it's all calm and my weight I weighed myself today I was like 63 kilos which is fine like I just need to be a bit more comfortable that I'm not actually 60 kilos like before I left to Thailand, I was like 60.5, 61, but I put on some weight in Thailand, which is all chill. I don't really care that much. Um, but for hill climb season, like I'll definitely lose weight just because when I'm back home, I don't eat as, out as much because it's so expensive. So I just eat better. Um, and also in Thailand, I was eating like so much more food than I normally do. Um, but anyway, like there and back, I just soft pedaled, didn't really like literally was just like doing 100 watts or whatever. Like you can see like average watts 145. I just wanted to go full gas on the climb. Uh, and see what numbers I'm at. So for me, I feel like I'm 375 here, and I think I'm not sure which hill climb. A couple of hill climbs, maybe five minutes or so. I need to figure out exactly which ones I'm going to do, but I should be able to do maybe like 420 to 440, I think, for five minutes. That should be achievable, I think, because I'm at 400 at the moment while well, I'm in good form, and I think I'll be in better form then. So hopefully, you know, we'll be able to do like 420, 430, but we will see. I might not be able to, and also hopefully we'll be able to get down a little bit of weight but the weight doesn't bother me like too much the main thing is just the watts like obviously at high watts per kilo if you lose weight it does make a difference but at the same time it's uh it's something that i don't really want to be over concerned about just because it's like i don't know you can control your power a lot more easily um than your weight unless you just want to starve yourself which to be honest like i don't really because these are important but like at the same time i do actually enjoy living like a functional life and not just eating like 2,000 calories a day and right, and training and then just like trying to survive. Um, but anyway, it's all calm. Uh, and I am I think, yeah, you know, next time I'll do another effort at Box Hill maybe um, in a couple of weeks and see if we can get break sub five. Like that's, that's decent. I mean, on this on this leaderboard, you'll be able to see like, um, like uh, there are a lot of pros on this, like a lot of pros because Ride London comes up here. So this guy did it on his own. This guy, they're both nutters. They did it on their own. But all the guys here, they've um, pretty much all done it in the bunch. He didn't. Uh, Sam Harrison didn't. But everyone else, you can see, pretty much has done it in the bunch. Uh, again, that guy didn't. He's outrageously strong. Uh, for this, like, to get the KOM, you need to probably do, you know, 7.8 watts per kilo, maybe something about that. Because I know 
this guy here, Callum Clark, I think did like 7.4 or something. So probably like 7.6, 7.8 watts per kilo, which is quite frankly insane. Um, if we just go on like people I'm following, we'll be able to see where I sit. So like I beat Dalsit when he was doing Ride London. Um, it's about the same time as Lawrence Ten Dam. Um, I'm not sure, 10th of August 2014, I'm not sure what was happening then. Uh, we beat a couple other people like... Um, like Will Clark, Madge Schmidt, they were all doing like six minutes. Obviously, it's in a race, um, but then you can see there are some other people who I thought I would, I thought I'd be able to get sub five, which is you know like sim similar time to the pro guys. Um, but obviously, they're doing the race. Um, if you see it's in July, then it's the race. So like this year, Ryan Mullen did like five oh two. So you know, like I'm for sure I should definitely be further up than where I am. Um, like five minutes twenty isn't isn't great. Obviously, some of these these times are drafted. Some of them, some of them aren't drafted, but. I don't really care if it's drafted or not. I know I can get sub five solo, so we'll just do that. But that's, I mean, that, that's not a goal per se. It's just something that will happen when I get fitter. Uh, but anyway, cheers for watching. Hope you did enjoy. Um, I can't really do any race footage because they all just get taken down. So I'm not really going to be doing any race footage for a while until I think they're not going to get taken down because it just does, like, there's no point making, like, spending my time doing a race footage and then, like, two days later it just gets taken down. Um, which is quite annoying, even though I like I enjoy doing them, and obviously they get a lot of views as well, so it is annoying. But look at this, we've got 683,000 people have been up Box Hill on Strava. I think it's one of the most popular segments ever um, in the world. I think there's one in Richmond Park which might be uh, more popular, but it's pretty insane, actually. Almost 100,000 people have done this climb, um, which is great. I'm not sure why there's a difference discrepancy. It says 99,000 there, and it says 99,400 here. I don't know. But anyway, cheers for watching. Um, and yeah, you'll see it more things like this about hill climbs, etc. And I'll have a lot of GoPro footage of the hill climbs, even though it does give a little weight penalty. And I'll see you in the next vid.